Hello everyone, welcome back to Nate the Hoof Guy. Today's video, we have got a cow with a white line lesion on her left front foot. Now, in a lot of my videos, I've worked on uh, lesions before like this, white line lesions. A lot of those situations, it was much more advanced. Today's situation, what you're gonna see is um, a white line lesion in the very early stages. When I refer to an abscess or a white line lesion, what I'm referring to is a small perforation in the white line, which is in the area uh, between the outside wall of the foot and the sole of the foot. There's a little line there um, that is the junction between those two, and it's kind of a kind of like it's a glue that holds those two together. Well, when I'm talking about an abscess, what we've got is a perforation there that becomes infected. Um, a lot of times I've shown cracks in other videos. Some cracks um, may lead to an abscess. Some are just perforations that never got infected. What we're looking at here is one that has gotten infected. And here you can see that split um, and has allowed bacteria and stuff to enter and get inside all the way into that junction. And that's causing pressure in there. So now what I have to do is notch this out and, and release that pressure to, to get us down to new horn again and um, allow this area to heal back up. From this angle here, you can get a real good look at that split right in that white line. And these are caused from a cow, perhaps that she slipped or um, she made a sharp turn. Something caused that outside wall to pull away from that solar horn. And we get a little split there. Then um, bacteria were able to get in that split and actually cause an infection inside. So what I need to do now is pair away very carefully really thin layers here and try to get down to that that um, the actual infection spot. The hard part about this is is there's not a lot of sole separation here because these are this is such a fresh um, abscess. So right above you can see right where that little blood spot is. If you look right above that right now it looks almost like it's um, like it's pushing out and that's from that pressure. You'll be able to see this as I release that um, what's actually causing this pressure but that's all due to that, that split in that wall, getting infected, and then um, the result is what we have here. And there's the release of that pressure. We gotta get that infection out of there. We're gonna slowly uh, pair away and try to open this little hole up a little bit. Like I said, this isn't gonna be a, a large area of soil separation like you've seen before. This is just fresh, so it's just a tiny little spot here. Um, we're going to get that opened up, um, sprayed out, cleaned out. We are going to still put a block on that other claw. This type of white line lesion, or this at this stage, heals up very quickly. Within a couple of days, even if I didn't put a block on, this would heal over nice, and she wouldn't even show um, any signs of uh, real um, lameness from it. These heal up really quick. I'm, I'm going to put a block on anyway, just because I want that immediate comfort. I want her to get over this uh, today and not a couple of days from now. So we're just going to get this cleaned up, put a block on her, and uh, send her out and see how she walks. With a lesion this small, there's no need to put a wrap on this. Just a good spray with some chlorhexidine, kill all the bacteria around it. And like I said, within a couple of days, she's gonna be good as new. Well, that's gonna do it for today, guys. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.